Hey, this is Ben from Implements Direct. Today uh, we're doing a demo video of the Zagroda concrete mixer. This is a pan concrete mixer. Um, it's available in three different sizes. This particular one we've got on video is 800 litres and it's hydraulically driven. It's got a hydraulic motor uh, chain driven to the, um, to the mixing uh, paddles. Um, we've also got them available in uh, PTO drive, um, such as a standard PTO shaft, and also hybrid drive, which uh, it can be either PTO or hydraulic driven in the same mixer. Um, this particular model um, is 800 litre capacity, which is 0.8 of a cubic metre. Um, also got them in sizes of 600 litre, which is 0.6 of a cubic metre, and 1.2 cubic metres, or 1200 litres. Um, you'll be able to find all those on our website. So this mixer um, is mixing uh, just standard concrete. We've got um, it being loaded with a small excavator and um, yeah, each, each mix has uh, got about five bags of cement, that's uh, 40 kg bags and um, uh, sufficient water, maybe about two or three bucketfuls of water. So we're adding the cement and uh, water and uh, the, the sand and gravel mix in incrementally so we're doing one, one bucket of sand and gravel, one uh, bag of cement and, and then say a bucket of water and letting it mix before we add the next lot. That way we're getting a, um, a consistent brew each time. Um, as you can see there's an integrated cement bag breaker on the, on the top of the lid there. That makes it really easy to, to empty the bag of cement in. you just got to basically lift it up there, throw it on top of that, um, <coughs> that breaker and, and, and then fold the bag in half and all the contents fall into the mix. Um, as the paddles are going around it, it, it obviously mixes the cement in very thoroughly. Right, this is the last bag of cement for this mix. Uh, so it's had five bags. Um, and probably about uh, four or five bucketfuls out of the digger of sand and gravel mix. Um, so this is a, a, a 0.8 of a cube mixer. Um, and you can see that the, the mix is up around the top of the springs on, on, the, um, on the paddles there. And uh, there's a maximum fill sign on the, on the side. The mix is, is, is about that level. Um, <coughs> what you've got to make sure is that uh, the weight of the concrete plus the mixer does not exceed the, the lifting capacity of your tractor. Obviously, otherwise you're going to load it up and not be able to go anywhere. So it's pretty easy to empty out. Just open that rear door, and um, you know the mix is pushed out by the paddles as they as they're going round. It's pushed out to the outer um, perimeter of the of the mixer and out through the output chute. It's um, pretty much going to empty itself uh, entirely. You can shut that, that gate off to, um, to stop the mix at any stage and um, you know, uh, gives you some control over how much uh, you don't have to open it all the way up like we've done there. 